Okay. Let's go pick peanuts off the vine. All right, folks. We're going to pick some peanuts today. We're going to hog them. That's what we call it. And this is the way we do it. Uh, we're going to take them home and we're going to boil several different kinds. I think we're going to do some Cajun. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, but, but these peanuts grow on vines. So what is hog? But they grow on the roots of the vines. See? So, all the hogs I've been killing, I'm picking my share. You just take that. Feed the rest of it to the deer. She's got her dress on. <laughs> Let me do it. Now you find that first one. There you go. You gotta dig down in there. Look at the peanuts though. It's so dry. Yeah, you gotta, there you go. There you go. That girl ain't scared to get a little dirt. And we can pick these up off the ground where they're just shaking loose. If we had some rain, it would, it would break this, you know, soften this ground up some. And it would make this a whole lot easier. But y'all see how it's happening? Just rolling them up as she's going back. Pretty neat, huh? Pulling them off the roots into the ground. They were probably growing hard clay ground, but. That we grow them down in the south is because of this sandy soil. It doesn't get all packed. If it's got any clay in it, that's the reason they don't grow them all over the country, is because of the sand. We got enough sand here. Yeah, they would pick a whole lot better if it was wet. Pick them on. Super peanut. green peanut. Okay. Let's make some Cajun. Down here in the south, it's a southern thing. Not a lot of people up north know what boiled peanuts are unless they travel down here going to the beach or something and stop and get some. But we have the world's largest peanut bowl in Luverne, Alabama, not too far from here. And they've got cookers. I mean, they've got a whole, it looks like a chicken house, a big giant chicken house, just, just a big barn and it's full of cookers and people come from all over the country to get them boiled peanuts. Look at that. And if you got any sand or roots, pick all that out and boil that too. You're not, it's not like you're making soup out of it. We're just eating the peanut itself, so. All the sands on the bottom. One quart. Two quarts. And now we're going to add our Zatarain's crab bowl oil. So 
was half a teaspoon. Be careful with this stuff right here, because this will take paint off, probably. <laughs> the way it smells. <laughs> it's it, so strong. It's, it's concentrate, so. I'm a little scared. It says put, I don't know. a pot for about an hour maybe a bit longer we'll see Ooh, you can smell it put it on there for 70 minutes you can always take the lid back off they're not tender put it back on i like mine not like mushy but i don't like to chew on them either much you know it's it's a fine line between perfect and overcooked or undercooked so you just got to play it by ear you don't have to have an instapot to do this you can do it over the stove that's the way we've always done it we're just going to try it with instapot because it's a whole lot faster we don't want to sit here and have to boil for anywhere from two to eight hours depending on what you're working with but we're going to see what it'll do in 70 minutes on the instapot Quick, fast, and in a hurry, we're going to be eating Cajun boiled peanuts here in just a little bit. All right, sweet pea. What are we going to do with the rest of the peanuts? We've got the Cajun peanuts boiling right there. So what are we going to do with these? We're going to honey roast them. Honey roast. Okay, yeah. so if y'all want to see how to take these raw green bowl, or peanuts and honey roast them, the video on how to do this, y'all need to check out her page. You're very excited. Very excited. Roasted. Yeah. You know when you go to a fair and you get those super crunchy honey roasted peanuts? Yes. That's what we're going for. Yeah, that's what she's going for right here. It's going to be good. Super hot. <laughs> super hot. You know what it smells like? Bull peanuts. <laughs> they smell just like bull peanuts. That's so weird. Are you boiling peanuts over there? I think so. Oh. I think that's what this is. Let me see. Yeah. Oh, here you are. No, they're perfect. Are they? Mm-hmm. Oh. Yeah, that's that rinse. That's good. They turned out awesome. <laughs> they're a little warm. Tender as mother's love. Perfect. And we've got honey glazed peanuts in the oven right now. So y'all make sure you check that one out. They're going to be good too. That's what we've been doing, shelling them. Now you can make them as hot as you want to. As salty as you like them, these are perfect. Mm. If y'all hadn't tried boiled peanuts, you ain't living. What do you think of the Canadian oh. version? Okay, they're delicious. <laughs> That's better than the boiled peanuts. Deli so, we let them sit for an hour and 20 minutes. So you see as most of them are sunk now. And the water's still hot, so. We're gonna can them so we have snacks for the tree stand. All right, need a little juice. Don't wanna fill it up too. Appreciate y'all.